So at the end of first episode, the last episode, we've picked up our little mate called Stranger. He's a stranger. Stranger danger. So he, his bit of spiel at the start was, he wants some help getting through this area. And he's not going to stab me in the back. We shall see about that. Got a funny feeling it might be a patches. Want to head down? Ah, uh, there seems to be a big beast there. What's the other way? I can see an item down there. Oh no, it's not even an item. It was the water droplets. On my way. Oh, it's the same bloody area, look. An ambush. Oh, it's an ambush, alright. Stab him in the back, quick. Cat. Oh, this guy's got an ape shit. Bloody hell. St strange as an absolute beast. I want to see if you can actually sneak up on people. Because it seems like everybody knows where I am. Oh, fuck this guy. Oh, big fella. Now watch this. Combination. Nice. That's quite valuable. Let's use it well. Well torn wool. Ah, oh, you cheeky bastard. I'm firing shots. Shots fired. It does feel pretty nice to play like. Seems a bit easy at the minute, but. It's a way that I came down there. So what have I missed? Because he wants to come through here. Like, are these the same ladders? Oh, I've just realised I've got a mini-map in the upper right-hand corner. <laughs> I didn't even see it. That's good. That's good that we've got that. Sorry. I'm on my way. Don't be sorry, mate. Your blood has special properties that can activate dried up blood springs. Once revived, the blood spring will start producing blood beads again. These blood beads have the same composition as human blood. Revenants have been using them to quench their blood thirst. We've got to get that, that back to really our mate. Yes, it really is. You now know the truth and I have to kill you now. Fill me in on the details later. This guy, this guy's just chatting to himself as if I'm saying things to him. I think he's a bit crazy, son. We're not far from the surface now. I just want mad loot. What do we have here? Queen Slayer blade. That doesn't sound like a big weapon.
It's actually terrible compared to the one I found. Pretty good having a little companion. He, he spots the enemies before I do. Did you pick up something we can use? Oh my god, does this guy ever shut up? Did you pick up something we could use? No nah, mate, everything I pick up is my loot. Get your own. Watch your step. This guy's too aggressive. This, this guy's formed from a hole created by a thorn of judgment. He's far too good. Like, I'm not getting a chance to fight the bloody enemies before they die. Although he's quite good on fighting them blobs. No one ever likes You've fighting blobs in games. The backstab is pretty temperamental like. Oh what's this? Oh it's one of them things. Oh, so that's how you map them, find the little red flowers. Okay. Did we miss anything? I don't know. Oh, we're on the surface. Finally. This yeah, looks pretty nifty. Light from the surface. It reminds me of a uh, Fist of the North Star. How say like post apocalyptic. Once someone is lost, they can never come back. Cast aside your doubt. Ching! Maybe you can't backstab this guy. Nah, I don't think you can. Have a combo. I oh, didn't work. Oh, what did he? What? Oh, he's turned into he's turned into him. Smau, Smau and Ornstein. I can't backstab him. Oh, maybe because he's a boss. Oh, shit. Right, he's getting one of these up. Have one of these, bitch. It's a whopper. Oh, 
or using a tackle. Great, I lost. Juggernaut sledgehammer. Nice. She's all right. By the way, both of you, all revenants must pay a levy. There are no exceptions. A vestige. Best to stay away from those stones. Anyone who touches them is defiled, transformed into the lost. Don't listen to their whispers. Someone has to be sacrificed. Without blood beads, we won't make it. Once she's settled down, let's get out of here. So those crystals talk to us. I'm gonna pick it up. Oops. Wait, what are you... Let go! It'll swallow you up! It's alright. You can do it. Oh, she's got the power! Oh, she's definitely the chosen one. Let us keep them just this once. We won't make it if you take them. All revenants must pay a levy of blood beads. There are no exceptions. Sorry. It's like the... It's like the dream sequence from Fallout 4. When you're going through the blood beads, we won't make it. The memory chip inside of Kellogg's head. The few humans that remain are under Silver's control. Wandering reverence like us are forced to hunt for blood beads or face death. Even if some reverence must be sacrificed for our survival. Guess you reap what you sow, right? Well, that's all right. What's important is that at least one of us makes it. So dramatic. The way the men talk in this, it's it's like bitch mode. The most believable people in this game have been the women so far. The men are proper limp, limp-wristed fools. This. Is a memory echo. It's a place where lost recollections still wander. Come, let's move on. If you use that stairway, I believe it should take us back to the world outside this memory. <laughs> I can see your crack. See your crack, girl. Is this the past of one of the lost? No. Look, he shit himself. There's no way. That mobility affects dodge movement. Your mobility changes according to the weapons and blood veils you equip. Okay. Is a blood veil just the armor? It hasn't really explained it very well. 
Shit! What the hell was that? It was a memory carved into that vestige by the one who left it behind. I didn't expect that I'd get dragged into it, too. We both melted into you. Yeah. I can't believe this. Sounds like a what fucking a party. Come with me. I know a spot where we can rest. I'm Louie. I'm researching blood beads. Nice to meet you. Oh, we know what you want, Louie, you dirty man. Come with me where we can be alone. Berserk of Vestage Core. Code or owner, Oliver Collins. Features high strength and endurance. Its low eye core stock can be offset with heavy armor. Ah, uh, okay. Let me check this out. Berserk, that sounds like me, like. Or is that in place of the warrior? Did I? Like, that's the thing about games, like, I understand games and, like, bringing up that whole new world and stuff, but if you just give things normal, everyday words that we can understand, like, class, change your class shard and your armor and weapon, like, would understand what that is. Ugly, isn't it? The Red Mist showed up a short time after the Queen was defeated. And when it did, it trapped everyone and everything inside, giving birth to the Society of Revenants ruled by Silva. The Jail of the Mists. As time passed, that was the name people gave to the world inside. The creatures trapped inside the miasma wander in a never-ending cycle of death and rebirth. Always searching for blood beads to sustain them. Revenants need to have blood. Without it, they turn into those creatures we call the Lost. The Revenants who captured you were desperately searching for blood, terrified of losing themselves. It's a common fate these days. But ripples are beginning to form. You cleared the miasma and revitalized the blood spring. Where did you learn to do that? You've forgotten? <laughs> Anything you do remember? It's unusual, losing so much of your memory. I suppose it was the same for her. I thought our character had a voice. Let's take it easy. Make yourself at home. She never ever speaks. Ah, I've got a home base, got a hub. Uh, what what good here? A shop. We've got a bar. Yeah. We'll just sit and enjoy. Enjoy life. Right, can I get up now? Oh, we've got a special item. Oh, this is a training area. I don't want to do that. Well, wait there, I do. Let me try out that Berserker thing. It is. Okay. So Blood Code is this. This is your class. So what does this actually do? Gives me lower health, more stamina, less eye core, more balance, mobility slow, weight limit, plus 130. 
it'll only really boost my attack by five. I'll try it out. Right, so we can train there, which is pretty nice if we want to. Let's go and speak to some guys. There you are, the revenant that Louis sees so much potential in. I'm Davis. I go around for the provisional government as part of the investigation into the depths. Just as a warning, try not to stir up any trouble. If you do, I won't be able to do my job and get it right I get it can I have a shot of your ghetto blaster no thanks nice to meet you if Louie brought you here there must be some reason right I'm Rin Murasame I provide the back home support for all the explorers here it's a pleasure I've got my own reasons for why I can't go into combat with you but I'll provide your weaponry and maintain it for you Anyway, relax and make yourself at home. <laughs> I'm a proper pervert. Hey, come on, I want to. I want to. Sh want to I'll take care of all your. All revenants carry some secret with them. Don't do anything funny. I'll be keeping an eye on you until this talk with Louis settles. Yes, yes, yes. It's warm here, isn't it? Everyone wants to know more about me. I don't know the answer to any of their questions. All I can remember is that my name is Io, and that my place is by your side. My name... I, I have no idea what it means. I think the reason why you're here by yourself is because you're born as fuck. You take like eight days to get a sentence out. Talk to Louis to gather more info. Okay then. I like your car, pet. You're an unfamiliar face. Has Louis stuck his head into another pot of trouble? Well, it's none of my business, really. Anyway, I'm Coco, a merchant by trade. Stop by if you need anything. I do. Sorry, but I'm in the middle of. T so you know, what's the point? We're not allowed to get anything off anybody. Oh, you can change your character anytime you want. Oh, that's pretty good. Season pass bonus. Talk to the figure in the underground storage to have the season pass NPC alternate Mia White accompany you as a partner. Harbinger. Blood code. Underground storage, how then? I want some extra blood cords. Yeah. Nice. Co owner Mia, so that's her with the car. Balance and stability in combat. And features gifts useful for exploration. High power and unique gifts that can only be used to those with determination. Massively lowers my attack. But wait, there's other things to check, isn't there? Like, um. Oh, you can't do it from here. You've got to do it at a, a bonfire where we 
check the upgrade on a on a class. Right, can we like progress now? Weight limit. So how do I know how much weight I'm carrying? 110 out of 250 at the minute. Oh no, your weight limit is your equip load. Ah, see, I see. Juggernaut sledgehammer. I'm using that. Right, aim. Um, speak to me, mate. You're looking a bit tired. We can talk again later. Let's get out of here. So this, four gifts out of this. Sacrifices HP to heal your partner. Restores your re regeneration power when your partner reaches zero HP. Temporarily lengthens the effect of gifts used by you and your partner. Fires a projectile. Desperate burst. Deals massive damage to the area around you, but leaves you on the brink of death. <laughs> Berserker. Increases the power of the next attack. Dash forward and make a powerful overhead attack. An offensive skill performed with two handed swords hammers. Oh, passive skills. Increases balance. Reduce damage taken by weaving a barrier into your blood. I like this one, me. So wait there, right? I've got this equipped. Blow of Madness. I can use Blood God as well. And Triple Annihilator. Even though I'm in this class, I can use them. That's pretty cool. So if I'm in this skill tree here. What do I want out of this? Passively increases balance. You have discovered gifts latent potential. Once you become fully proficient with a gift, you'll unlock the ability to inherit it. Ah, okay. Okay, wait there, right? I think I... How can you tell if you're... Oh, all of these you're inherent with it. But these aren't, because look, they're... they've got like a little bar underneath them. Proficiency requirement. Defeat the enemy. So what we should really do is increases the drain rating of weapon attacks. We could get all of the important ones. I forgot I've never even been using God actually, I've only been using Dodge. That's pretty good, that. 
Increases maximum stamina. Right, well, wait there. Let's see if we can get proficient in these. Okay, so as, as long as I'm this class... As long as I'm this class with this... Balance up. If we, I imagine if we kill enough enemies, that'll become a permanent fixture. And then I'll switch to the other class and learn the stamina one. Right, well, tell you what, I'm just going to level up now. Done. Right, come on then, I just want to go. How, what? How do we progress? Have I got to go to bed? Or oh, what's this here? Hot spring. What the? Oh my god, this is, this is, this is the best. I'm going to go and chill in the hot spring with all the bitches. Ladies, ladies, ladies. What? <laughs> what is this game I'm playing? Yeah, I just, I just want to, I just want to, um, play the game. How do, I don't know, I don't know how to progress. Can you tell us where to go, mate? A bit tired. You can tell oh, fuck me. Just... I just want to play the fucking game. Aye, oh, man, I didn't care. Go to bed. That's not what I'm supposed to do. Oh my god, look, it's got a zoom in feature. Yeah. Oh, we can just become a maximum pervert, look. Funny shot. Uh, but that hasn't helped me in my situation. Can I just... Go to fight enemies? What, what am I doing here? Does anybody know what the fuck I'm doing here? It's really boiling me piss now. What a shit fucking game. It doesn't... Oh. And our Dark Souls doesn't tell you what... Well, tell you what I'm going to do while I'm here. Because it's just really pissed us off with me OCD here, right? Even though I haven't got OCD. But accessories, this is the wrong colour. How do I progress? I'm talking to Louis. That's Louis, in it. You're looking a bit tired. Your, your friend is probably. <sighs> Fucking hell, man! It's at all my... Oh my god! I had to speak to this stupid bitch. I'm not one. And I. It seems if it. The ability to draw strength from experiencing memories. Sorry, but could I get a sample of your blood? We might understand more if we analyze. It won't be much. Just a small vial, so you won't need to worry about bloodthirst. It'll take a while to get the How results. Hadn't. Take it easy in the room back there while you wait. Absolutely terrible. You're telling me you had to speak to people to progress. That was just dog shit, that like. What, what, what am I doing? What game am I playing? I thought this was a Dark Souls game, not a fucking chat em up. Are you happy? I've done what I can. Rev, how you're you? Supposing you are a void type. There's a test I'd like to... I'm going to give you some of my belief. My theory is correct. It should act as a medium. Give my power... Well, here it goes.
Prometheus. Well balanced for combat but fragile. It gifts bolster dodging and parrying. Also you can parry. That was not explained to me. It's not as good as the Berserker. Right. Did you go visit Murasame and Coco? They should be re weapons that you should once you've Also now they can do business after I've spent all of my points. Fucking great. Oh, good timing. Transform equipment. Which weapon do you want to transform? I am this one. Ah. Okay, that's cool. Which blood bale do you want to transform? Also, blood veil is your armor. everyone's hard work I can offer new weapons take a look if you'd like great buying something oh I want the blanched great sword how much is that 10 oh yes just bought a whopper I'll Take buy a blood veil. Yeah, I want to buy. buy some armor. Buying something? Oh, these are really expensive. An ogre type blood veil used by the lost. Low durability but extremely lightweight. Oh, stuff got durability on it, has it? I want to sell some shit. Actually, I'll keep everything. Okay. What about you? I've got just a. If you want it, I got it. Throwing weapons, drugs. Blah blah blah. Come again soon. Okay, I think I'm ready to go. Can we can we play the game? You remember that scene we witnessed at the vestige? That kind of stuff happens every day here. Silva has taken most of the humans who survived under his protection. So revenants are left to rely on blood beads alone to slake their unending thirst. But... Well... Nothing in this world lasts forever. The springs started to dry up, and so blood beads grew rarer and rarer. And the order Silva created by levying and distributing blood beads... ...won't last much longer either. The world needs more blood beads. Only then can we strive for fairness instead of petty favoritism. That's why we've been exploring the Jail of the Mists. We're doing research to learn all we can about blood beads. But the miasma has been a real problem. It makes our thirst even worse, so our progress has stalled. Now, though, we have a glimmer of hope. 
Your power can clear the miasma. If you could help us... Well, we'd be drawn into a better conflict. Still, the truth is, we don't have a lot of hope without you. Will you join us? <sighs> Thanks. So, it's a done deal? <laughs> well then, from now on, you're one of us. Yakumo Shinanome. <laughs> I'll be looking forward to seeing you in action. Let's get right into it. Here's what's going on. We're studying blood beads and their springs. We want to know how and when blood springs appear, their cycles for producing beads, and the composition of the beads themselves. We've made a few discoveries. First of all, we found that there are tubes like capillaries running through the earth. We call them blood veins. We so call them blood borns. Every single blood spring is located on top of one of these blood veins. Also, after comparing blood beads and blood veins, we now know that they are mostly comprised of the same substances. In other words, we can safely assume that blood springs always form along blood veins. We think that means there must be a source somewhere. A kind of headwaters for the blood beads. Now that we have you around to clear the miasma, we can investigate the springs and follow the blood veins. And hopefully, find the source. Right? We want to check out the old city ruins first. Sorry for the rush, but we should head out as soon as you're ready. The rush I've been trying to get out here for 15 minutes. Moving from missile to missile, you can now move from one missile to another. Right. Bonfire time, let's go. Certain allies at the base will accompany you as a partner when you explore. They can use gifts to grant buffs, buffs before battle as well as heal you. Each partner has their own unique fighting style. So can I pick anybody to come with me? What about her? I've got just about anything you could want. Come again soon. What about the guy with the apple? I'm taking the guy with the apple. Hey, what's up? Switch partner. See you around. Is something up? Head out whenever you're ready. I don't like him because he, he sounds like a little bitch. He might be. I like this big juggernaut looking guy. Ah, oh, he looks like a beast. It was easier to explore when we could use all the missile, but now even the staunchest explorers are swamped. They must have left coordinates leading to the depths. If you find any maps of the depths out there, I'd appreciate it if you showed them to me. We'll take care of the rest. Your but you can't. You can't take him. I'm going to take this guy because this guy actually sounds... Can we take her? Given vestiges parts found in your exploration will allow you to restore deficient gifts for the blood cords. It also reveals the hidden memories. Right? It seems I can... If you find any... It could... Now, I'm going to take this guy. Let's try this guy out. Hey, what's... Actually sounds you alright. Made a good choice. Yeah. Yeah, I did. What? Oh my god, how... <sighs> how do I fucking leave this cunt? I 
just want to play the game. Oh, fucking right bumper. I just, I think once I get going with this game, I'll enjoy it. I enjoy the combat, but there's far too much chat and shit in one down about talking to fucking idiots I didn't even like. I just want to cut things up. Residents of the world. Um, it allows other people to enter areas that you've explored. Try returning to a place you've visited before, and you might just encounter someone new. Uh, well, that might be fantastic, but I didn't really care. Oh, this guy's got a whopper of a sword. Task done. So far, look at my sword. He's jealous. I think he's compensating for something. Right. Um. This way. Oh, who's this? Oh, you're exploring this area too. Yeah. I'm a merchant of sorts. I wander around selling valuables as I explore. The miasma has gotten pretty thin here lately, eh? I thought it might be dangerous, but I came all the same. I haven't seen a fellow. Ex I'll be around here for. If you have any materials from the old world, I can give you valuables in exchange. Ah. Well, I found some fragrant tea. That's a choir valuables, right? I don't want that. I want to sit. Nah. Don't hesitate to Might use them for something else. Accessing the depths. Bringing maps of the depths of Davis at home base allows you to explore different paths of the depths. Enemies are frightening and the exploration is tough, but haze and upgrade materials can easily be acquired. Right. You got something we can use? I found a viva a vivifier, mate. This way leads into the old city. Good, this is where I'm headed. Nice. I think I'll prefer this over the the big axe I was using. Or even the hammer. Then again, I never got a chance to use the hammer, did I? Quite like that attack. Map of the depths. Let's take it to Davis. Do I have to do that now? This level design, though. That level design. <laughs> wow. Oh, look how slow I am at rolling. Oh, maybe that's what it... Maybe that's what the mobility talked about. It's up ahead. This is oh, it might be... Oh, it might be the equipment I've got. Oh, maybe not. I'm not sure. Expectations exceeded. That settles it. You are absolutely vital to our operation. There are more blood springs ahead, but the miasma is blocking the way forward. Do you think you could clear it for us again? How many times did this guy want to shake my hand? Thank you. I think he likes just touching us. We know where two springs are thanks to past expeditions. Let's go have a look at them. The 
territory up ahead is teeming with the lost. Watch yourself. Right, come on, finally, let me get into some combat. Communal gifts, oh my god, there's so much shit. Require the cooperation of a partner in exchange for great power they grant, the exact price from their use as well as active and consume large amounts of ICO. Price and effect of communal gifts vary by partner. Oh, this right. place is nice and open. Oh yes, it's, it's beautiful. A ghost town. I can hear someone whispering. So many blind spots. Bring it any time. Oh, he's got full three hundred and sixty degree attack, has he? Oh, the weapon stun on this is unreal. You have to take whatever you can use. Oh, you son of a bitch! Right, so the the love to ambush, did it? This is the perfect combination. The fact that we're both using great swords, we can just build up stun and stun lock everyone. The sunset sword. Quite a town. Too bad there's no one in it. Right, let's try a parry. Let's not. Right, I'm not sure if you parry by that didn't take too much effort. Press and block at the same time. Is there a tutorial? I uh, will find it later. Let's just kill loads of people. I'm pretty much gonna be using it. You f are you kidding me? The enemies in this are fucking bullshit. Stick it up your ass. Parking garage. Yeah. I'm all about this sword, like, it's a beast. The range on it as well. I think I'm gonna like this. I am now the hiding spots are a joke. Although you can walk and block at the same time, which I quite like. Got no health left. Going home's always an option. It's hard to nah. see up ahead. Oh look, we've got a big boy. <laughs> Dodge. Oh my god, the range. <laughs> Just beastness. Right, I just need to get used to the timings. Oh, we're gonna die here, like, I guarantee it. Oh, there's a save point there. I hope it's a save point. Hey, 
what is it? Yo, Ke Yo, Louis. You smell that? Yeah. Human blood. An escapee? Now, where did she run off to? Huh? Hey, chumps! What the hell are you doing here? None of your business. Oh, really? Then tell me this. Why would scum like you have the sweet stink of a human on you? The girl belongs to us. Put your paws on our property and your ash. That clear? <sighs> Fresh blood is some powerful stuff. You hanging in there? So, what's the plan now? We know it's just a matter of time until they find that missing human. You know the plan. Hell yeah. Let's hope she hasn't been devoured by horrors yet. Oh, it's not even a save. Oh, it is. It is. Ooh, happy days. I'm not sure if I want to level up yet. I might save my money for some better armor. I think I'll do that. Right, what I'll do is I'll call this an episode here. And when we come back, we'll continue exploring the... The old town. The old town in this car park. See you there, lads.